Hello guys, in this video I'd like to share with you how to fix the issue permit or not working in Spring Security. I am Nam Haming at Code in Java.net. So you know when developing REST APIs with the Spring Framework and Spring Security, you may get this issue using any request dot permit or in the security configuration class. However, sending a post request uh, still returns the error for all three forbidden. The reason is that Spring Security rejects post request due to missing CSRF token in the request body. You know, CSRF or cross site request forgery protection is enabled by default in Spring Security. So, to fix the solution to fix permit or not working is very simple. Just disable CSRF in the security configuration class. Let me show you. Yeah, I have a Java Spring Boot project, and in this uh, security config class, I have the configuration code that allows a request or request without any um, authentication here. Yeah auth dot any request dot permit or oh. okay the application is running and I will use uh, curl to test the API endpoint get a list of students here you see the base endpoint here localhost ATAT API slash students and you see, it is working normally. I got the status to our OK. However, if I send a post request to uh, add a new student like this, let me copy this command. OK, you see this curl command is used to uh, call the API and by API slash students post mapping here to proceed to add a new student with the name John Doe okay and you see I got the HTTP status 403 forbidden here error forbidden here although I said the security configuration class is permit or for any request here so it's because uh, CSRF is enabled by default. So to fix the issue, we need to disable CSRF here in the security configuration class like this. Dot CSRF and use uh, DSL syntax like this. CSRF CSRF dot disable. Very simple. Okay, and let me test the uh, API call again. Yeah, and you see now I got the status 201 created here. Yeah. And let me check by calling the get request to list all students here. Yeah. And you can see new student inserted here, yeah, John Doe. So it's a simple solution to fix the issue permit or not working in Spring Security. And you may ask me, is it safe to disable CSRF protection? You know, CSRF protection is only needed for web form submission. Uh, for REST APIs that are stateless, a single request must convey authentication information itself. So that means disabling CSRF for REST APIs has no risks. I hope you found this uh, video helpful. Please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share this video. Thanks for watching.